Hello and welcome to the Ethical World Network Gaming Com <laughs> The Gaming Competitive, I mean the new segment, pardon me. Anyways, today we are going to be discussing a very interesting story. Well, then again, I say that usually all the time. This story is somewhat controversial as it involves two contradictory things, health and soda. Now, you guys, of course, know Pepsi, right? Apparently in Japan, Pepsi has a line which is called special. Oh, it's Pepsi Special, not Speci Pepsi. Pepsi Special, yeah. And in Japan, this line apparently has a brand of Pepsi which is claimed to be able to prevent weight gain. So if you do drink the soda, Pepsi just guarantees you that, hey man, you're gonna lose weight and drink soda at the same time. You can have the best of both worlds here. Now that is one hell of a claim from Pepsi, and I know a lot of you are already shaking your heads like, what kind of crap is Etika feeding me this time? But it's kind of interesting, because here's the thing. Now, it's called Pepsi Special, and they're debating bringing it to America. And right now, here's the thing. The main ingredient that's used in this Pepsi Special in order to make you not gain weight is called dextrin. Now, it's a natural water-soluble dietary fiber which is derived from potatoes and apparently what it does is prevent fat from being absorbed by the body and used as, or rather it prevents calories from being absorbed by the body and used as fat and instead makes you just secrete them all out in your um, urinary or your, um, well, yeah, zone two. But anyways, now there's of course a lot of debate about whether this is safe or not if it's actually working, if there's more disbenefit than benefit. And the results are pretty across the board. I mean, there's so many people that say it's a good thing and a bad thing because the thing about dextrin is that it, it does at the same time make you lose weight, or rather not lose weight, but not gain weight, but there are pretty nasty side effects to it as well. People who have enjoyed dextrin in the past in other countries, by the way, which is outlawed in the United Kingdom, uh, basically dextrin is said to be able to um, cause bloating, cramping, diarrhea, and frequently loose bowel movement. Now you guys basically know what that means, right? If you eat a lot of dextrin, or rather intake a lot of dextrin, especially through this Pepsi special, while it may make you not absorb the calories and therefore excrete them, it's going to be a little bit of an inconvenience because you're going to be shitting half the day. So in a way, it's almost like a laxative, which has made the name of this Pepsi jokingly referred to, instead of Pepsi Special, as Pepsi Poop. And it's a very fitting name, actually, because that's basically what it does. It's basically a laxative. It makes it so that the calories aren't absorbed, and instead they go straight into the anus and out in crap. And, I mean, if this is the kind of, if this is the kind of thing that you believe would help you out, then of course I highly motivate you to try it out but at the same time it's still Pepsi it still has a crap ton of sugar uh, a massive amount of sugar which shouldn't even be ingested into the body at one time but they, they mix it with certain other chemicals in order for it to be able to uh, digest it well but if you ate that much sugar naturally you, you would vomit it all out instantly so the thing is is that Pepsi is still Pepsi at the end of the day I mean if you do get this dextrin it also has been seen to cause complications in digestive tract and uh, it cause actually, and it can actually also cause, um, apparently from what I'm reading here, it causes infections in the urinary tract as well if it's taken at a very high amount. So know what you're getting into before you buy this Pepsi special. I mean, I don't consume soda, so I won't be able to give you any follow-up on it or anything that would really let you know what this kind of product does. But hey, man, I mean, as long as you take it in moderation, you should be fine here. I can see this being somewhat beneficial for certain people, because, I mean, who doesn't mind a bowel movement extra here or there? I mean, it's actually good. It cleanses out the insides. Makes you a little bit less on the weight as well. So, in my honest opinion, it's kind of like a mid-vote for me. I would try it once just to see how it is and see if it works, but I probably wouldn't be drinking it on a regular basis, and you shouldn't either. Anyways, oh, by the way, the mayor of New York had that exact same thought, because now 16 ounce drinks are banned in New York City. Thanks a lot. So I go to 7-Eleven, what the hell am I going to get? A small slip? Like, you're not even supposed to be the mayor right now, Mayor Bloomberg. Anyway, whatever. My name is Etika. This is the Etika World Network News segment. Thank you for tuning in. Take care of yourselves, guys, and have a good one.